phone with us is Megan, who works at the Crater of Diamonds State Park in Murfreesboro, Arkansas. That's where Lunchbox will go out later today and start digging for diamonds. Hey, Megan, good morning. Good morning. How's your day going? Great. How are you? We're doing pretty good. We're very excited. Our guy's going to be out there digging. And so it, when people come out to that park to dig for diamonds, like what are the odds someone actually finds a diamond out there? It just depends on the day. We average two diamonds a day. So some days um, we'll have 10 turned in, and then some days we'll have none. Yep. Wow. Two a day turned in? That's our average. Wow. And do they look like diamonds, or do they look like funny-looking rocks? Um, our, the diamonds that come from this crater are actually really pretty. So they do stand out um, next to a lot of our other minerals you'll find in the mine. Oh, okay. When people find a diamond a day, basically, two diamonds a day, like what are those worth? It just depends. We typically don't try to appraise diamonds here. Um, we do just suggest that they go to a gemologist that's certified. Um, but we do register the diamonds here at the mine. Do you ever try to buy it off of them? Be like, hey, I'll give you 100 bucks for that right now. <laughs> Definitely not. Um, but, yeah, there's there are places in town you can buy raw diamonds. Can you explain to the people here on the show what the Crater of Diamonds State Park looks like? Is it just like a, is it look like a park? Is it streams? Is it like a cave? Yeah, so a lot of times folks think that when they come here and they hear about the mine, they're going to go down into the ground. Um, and a lot of folks are surprised that when you get out to the mine, it is just a large plowed field. Um, however, the park consists of a lot of other areas. We have a campground. We have a um, water park. There's lots of other things to do besides just mining here at Crater. Is there any chance that, I don't know, as a joke, we take some cubic zirconia, put it down in the ground, you lead lunchbox over there, he finds, like... <laughs> oh my gosh. No. Please. He okay. moves to an island. <laughs> Please do it. Yeah. Um, what, the biggest diamond that you've seen co with your own eyeballs is about how big? Um, the biggest I've seen is a uh, little over eight carats. Oh my. And do you have any idea what that ended up selling for? I do not. We do not know. You don't, you don't ever get curious, like, to find out when they do get it appraised, hey, call me, let me know? Um, yeah, we do. We try to keep up with some of our diamonds. After they get out into the market, though, it's hard to kind of track them. A lot of them end up in private collections, and so we don't see them after they leave here. Well, Lunchbox is going to be out there today digging, and he said if he finds a diamond worth a million dollars, he's quitting our show. What are the odds of that happening? Oh, nice. Um, well, <laughs> I hope all the best for him. That would be incredible. So, but I didn't hear any odds. Like, <laughs> um, yeah. So I don't know. I mean, you really there's you know days that you you were always surprised by who finds the diamonds, how often. Um, you just can't ever tell. Is there a spot you can point him that has the best shot at having a diamond in it, or is it just luck of the draw? I think it's just luck of the draw. It's it's kind of like it comes to you. Okay. Hey, thank you, Megan. We are, oh, Amy. That's Lunchbox's plan. Which is to come to you. To the, for the diamond to come to him and the earth to be like, here I am. Or he said something about a diamond god or something. Yeah, <laughs> diamond <laughs> gods, yeah. Do, does he have to dig it all for, the, for the, this or does it just... Can he rent tools there? How does that work? Yes, yeah, so he can rent tools here. You are able to bring your own tools. Um, some of the larger uh, diamonds are just found on the surface, so you don't have to have any tools. Can you wow. imagine? You just look down. There's a. Di I would love to plant some cubic zirconia. I know. Oh that. my goodness, that'd be the most <laughs> epic joke. Okay, hey Megan, thank you for your time and uh, appreciate you spending it with us. And good luck to not only Lunchbox but everybody else out there today. Thank you. Y'all have a good day. All right. Bye bye. All right. Bye. All right. We're about half hour away from Lunchbox digging for the diamonds at Crater of Diamonds State Park. I can't believe they find two a day. I can't yeah. believe that. Yeah, and I'm crazy. sure they don't know, or maybe they're just not supposed to comment on what the value is, because I would be so interested all the time. Like, well, I wonder, what did that sell for? How much is it worth? And then you would think, like, when you buy a lottery. put Apple trackers on their car. <laughs> <laughs> Track the diamond. Like, when you buy a lottery ticket, that gas station gets a percentage. Like, you'd think. Well, this is Earth. A gas station has to sign up and put a machine in. Okay, okay. Yeah, this is Earth just existing. <laughs> this is about the show.